you know, prayer is the answer. Yes, it is. Amen. So many things going on now. Yes. So many people struggle. Yes. Don't have no place. Some of them don't lay their head. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. So we asking everybody to bite your head where y'all. We we'll ask Pastor Jones to come and uh, lead us in grace. Amen. Father, we come once again yes, with our heads bowed and our mind on you. God, we're just so grateful to be in the land of the living to know that salvation is ours. Father, we thank you right now for the activity of our limbs. We thank you for the air that we breathe. But most of all, Lord, we thank you for a righteous heart. Our minds is weary sometimes, but we know in our heart we have hidden your word. Yes, Lord. That we may not sin against thee. This morning, Lord, as we meditate and focus on the throne of grace, we ask you to look in on the bereaved families, yes, members of this church, members of Church of Ord. We ask you, Father, to give them the peace, the joy, the satisfaction to know that absent from the body mm. is present with you, Lord. Mm. God, we ourselves don't know the time, day, or year that we ourselves have to lay this body down. But God, we thank you that we able to pray for those that have gone on to home. Lord, you heard our deacon this morning about his family. Yes, Lord. You heard our pastor talking about Reverend Evans' family. Yes. yes, sir. God, there are many that you have called home today. Yes. But we thank you, Lord, that we able to see this gorgeous day. Yes. Father, I ask you right now to touch every member yes. of 37th Street Baptist Church. Yes, sir. Those that are listening, those that are seeing, yes. I ask you, God, to touch them wherever the pain, whatever the sorrow, wherever the hurt may be. Yes. You are our Jehovah Jireh. Yes, yes. you are. Yes. You are our Jehovah Shalom. Yes. You are our healer. Yes. So we ask you, God, to touch this morning yes. wherever they may be and those that are here, we know that you are a God can do all things. And Father, we ask you in Jesus' name that you may watch over our president. Yes, sir. God, we know that you have called this man. And we know that you have sanctified him. And Heavenly Father, we know that he fears for his life as well. But God, you have encouraged his heart, you have encouraged his family to stand for you yes. and the people. I ask you, Lord, to keep thy hedge of protection around him and his family. Yes. I ask you, Lord, to place the right minds in government yes. to bring this recession to an end. Yes. Because people all over the world, Lord, are going through this recession, some losing homes, some losing jobs, some losing families. Yes. And God, we need your divine help. Yes. We need your wisdom, your way. Yes. So we ask you in Jesus' name, encourage our president, Lord. Yes, and God, we're thanking you right now for those that is sitting behind your sacred desk, yes, Lord. your pulpit, Lord. Yes. Asking you, God, to encourage them as well. Some is being talked about, 
Mm. Some is being criticized and laughed at. Mm. Yes, Lord. Mm. May God, you know the heart that you have called out of darkness yes. mm -hmm. into your marvelous light. Yes. I ask you to touch that man this morning. Yes. Touch, yes. touch that woman, Lord. Yes. I ask your Father to strengthen them where they are weak. Yes. I ask you, Lord, to watch over their families as well. Yes. And Lord, in this place, yes. you know our needs. Yes. You know our wants. Yes. May God, we're here today in your sacred house yes, to celebrate the coming day of Jesus Christ. Yes, Father, we know that by man that the 25th of this month is celebrating the birth of Christ. And God, no one knows the really time but you, and no one knows the day. But God, we recognize the three wise men as they came and they brought gifts. Yes. So we sanctified that day of a day of giving gifts to family members, to friends. But the most important gift of all yes, yes. is to say thank you, Father, thank thank you. Yes. for giving us your beloved Son, yes. Jesus yes. Christ. Yes. Yes. So I ask you, Lord, to touch these members. Keep them by power divine. I pray that they don't lose faith, that they don't faint not. Yes. But I ask you, God, to keep them even though it may get windy sometime. Mm -hmm. The rain may hit hard. Yes. But God, you're able to know how much they're able to bear. So in this Servant's prayer, I ask you, God, to keep them by power divine. And for our bishop, you know his ministry. You have blessed him. God, let someone hear and let someone see that the work that he does is not for his glory or for his honor, but it's for your glory and honor, Lord. Lord, give him the vision, the wisdom, and the know-how. Yes. And Lord, when it's all said and done, even send forth someone that may learn how he does things. Yes. So Lord, the day would come when he have to lay down his body. Mm -hmm. That may this ministry continue to go on to magnify your name. This is my prayer, in Jesus' name, yes. let the church say amen. 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 God bless you. Amen. Thank you.